Previously on the last Fortnite main series episode. Where am I? Who's that? Who is this? An old friend of yours. Because I am right here. If you are willing to work together like we used to, then I'll just have to claim you as one of my own. My dead body. <laughs> <Ow>! <laughs> You can run, but you can't hide. <laughs> you can't run. Get back here. I'm gonna get out of here somehow. Well, hello there. Hello. <laughs> oh, you can get away so easily. <laughs> <laughs> Die! Ow. <laughs> I told you, there's no escape from here. I only have one last word to say. Huh. And what is that, exactly? I'll see you in hell. <laughs> you aren't leaving! You aren't leaving! No, oh. don't leave! <laughs> Who are you? Hey, we we need no no harm. You do you remember my friend Rox? Sort of. I don't remember you. Oh, well, I'm Sky, and this is Arisa. Hmm. Nice to meet you, then. Oh Jesus. Oh my God. Oh! Oh my god. Duh. Come on! She's unconscious! But she looks different! For some reason! Different how? I don't know how to describe it, just... Help me! Please just save her. Core! Core! Come on. <coughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Demons from our past. If it's trying to kill us, it will. If we don't learn to contain it, it will kill us. And she said it would take over me. That it would take over the good side of Kiara, is what she said. Did she ever mention anything like that to you? Like, something about me? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Oh gosh. What? You're not safe. Hmm. 
Did you get enough sleep? I guess so. Okay. Oh, Kiara messaged me earlier, like an hour ago. She said, Arisa and I couldn't find any anything. I was trying to use my powers to find our temple. We couldn't find anything. We're going back to the area as soon as we can. We just have to do a few more things, including finding Dream. Oh yeah, the other part of Crystal. I forgot that dream lady was helping her out. Um, so yeah. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I should probably get my party going. You're worried about your parties right now? Well, the that's morning. not the only thing I'm worried about. Like, that's just a sub concern. Um, I'm just saying that because, like, I need to get the place running because it was kind of trashed a few nights ago. So I should probably get going and do two. I think it'd be easier that way I'm there when Dream comes there. That way I can confirm. You know what I'm saying? I guess it is a good idea. But just come back here later. Okay, don't worry. Besides, you'll be able to watch over Core and make sure she's okay and doesn't end up going in the portal again. I mean, the zero point, whatever that thing is. But, since she did get dragged in, don't you think it's not safe for her to be by it? Well, we're keeping her inside. Doesn't mean she can still get dragged in. Well, that was a one-time thing. We don't even know how those things work. It could grab any one of us. But, Core seems to be doing fine. We're inside, so... It seems like it only happens when it notices, like, either if it's a variant or something, because when Jules and Origin trace it, it's like it does it randomly, but, like, it's for a good reason. But in case it does get worse, we will send course somewhere else. Okay, and Well, I'm gonna get going. Bye, y'all. Bye. Cor, how are you feeling? Fine. Okay. Hey, did you look like this exactly when you were younger? I guess. Jesus. Okay. That is pretty insane. <laughs> um, pretty crazy actually. Oh, Rox is calling me. Um, give me a sec. What's okay. up, Rox? Hey. Hey, uh, what's going on? So, um... Did something happen? Yeah. What did? How do I describe this? Did you see something? Something out of the blue? Yes, hold on. Uh, describe it to me. Mm. I couldn't... I couldn't be sure it was a dark or white figure. Dark or white figure? Core, can you come over here for a sec? In your visions, or when you would go into that, when you were in the zero point, did you ever see a dark figure or something of some sort? Other than all this inside the cube of sauce and soul. Was it like no. a... 
Those are dark and purple. Rocks. Is that exactly what you saw? Dark and purple? Yeah. Oh, God. This isn't good. Hmm. Jesus. This is not good at all. Wait. But, like, was it like you were in another world, or did you just randomly see it while you were, you were outside? I just randomly saw it when I was outside. Mm -hmm. Cor, I think Alyssa Vons is making a target. Like, Kiara and you said, Kiara is in danger, and she knows you're here. She knows Kiara is on this island. Maybe she's getting the others to try to lead her to us. Maybe because Kiara's been protecting her mind from getting those visions or something or some sort. Maybe she's going after others in order to get to her. I don't know. I have to let Jules know of this. Uh, Rocks. I'll try to talk to you later. <laughs> Rocks? Hello? Why is there a static noise? Rocks? 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 Oh my god. It hung up. Shoot. I remember Rocks was getting coffee at Sleepy Sound. We need to go over there right now. Let's just get on the boat here. Don't worry, you'll be safe. Come on, let's get going. <laughs> hey, Arjun. Um, so I found these reality scanner things. I was looking for different variants because we were able to overlap the zero point, and I found something of core. I have found out for some reason, core doesn't have many variants of her left for some reason. You see, every person of this, of uh, everyone here, at least on the island, has at least over a hundred variants, maybe even close to a thousand. But from what I see, she only has four. And I researched it, and I think other ones had previously died. I found out that whoever can travel for realities, just like Kiara can, that she's able to, what should I call it? How do I explain it? She, she's able to move, well, so, hmm, hold on, this is a lot to process. Okay, like I was saying, I was just going for the computer, so she had must have seen something that we couldn't at some point. I mean, the places she was seeing, like, it has some meaning either from her past or something that had happened, right? Well, mm -hmm. I did digging, and apparently in other realities, Io had won the war. Somehow. So many but people died. This one. Yeah, it wasn't this one. But this other variant, they know her. This hero was known known as Demi, but except her mom died in her hands. So Demi was alive in this other reality, and in others, for the other case, Core was evil and just got killed by the agency team. You know, like the good people, like the Seven, and. I don't know, but you know as I'm saying. So, this isn't a variant of hers. Yes, there's another variant of her that looks exactly like her when she was younger. But the problem is, I haven't seen anything like this when I first started doing this sort of thing recently with y'all in the Seven. This variant of her is the younger one. You see this one right here? This one is exactly 24 years old. In that looks exactly like her. 
and she is 24 years old. She is her, her younger self. But when she went for that zero point, there, that variant got mixed with her. So that is still the same core, but she still has, like, she remembers everything, but she also has her old mindset when she was younger and she remembers things. And, well, like, of course everyone remembers things, but she has the mindset now of a 24 year old. She got mixed in with this, and which only means I have never seen something so scientifically possible. That means that when she got mixed in, she, in the first time in a long time, mixed in with her a variant of hers and claimed it as her own. And I think Alyssa Vaughn's, that's how she knew, or whatever the case was, because I guess she was searching for her in the first place to try to get to cure her. She went to that reality's variant, and I guess... She noticed that variant wasn't there and led straight to her path. I think that's how she was able to get a corset. Apparently, Alyssa Vaughn's connecting through this with everyone. She can reach from variant to variant until they come to this reality's one. Thing is, is that she already knows where we are just because of Kiara and the whole thing. And then, of course, you know, with the cubes and everything connected to this and IO. But the thing is, why is she taking her time? Why is she going one by one just from another variant? Is this just a part of some plan? Because like from what we've heard, Kiara is, she's going to try to make her like the second Sloan, her backup plan. That's the whole point she made her. So what if they're just, she's just doing that so she can try to mess with this, with our reality, this reality. origin do you think this could be any accurate possibly look we need to warn the others just in case we need to figure out what's going on hold on someone is calling me oh it's because i'm sky i gotta take this what's up sky uh rocks is in danger i need y'all as a sleepy Simon, tell me what the hell did you find on these reality scanners and what is the explanation of all of this Look, it's a lot to explain right now, but get get to uh, rocks and we'll be right over. Okay, please be careful. Okay, looks like we got what a different problem. Going? Let's go. We'll just leave the computer there. <sighs> just a fresh little sip of coffee with no one here in the room. I am good to go. I actually am kind of hungry though, so I'm going to get some food from down here. I really need to get my own house. That way I could literally just stay in there all day. What the hell happened to the fridge? Hey, seven guard. Oh, sorry. Uh, reporting for duty. Um, what happened? Uh, where did the fridge go? Oh, we moved it. Sorry. Where exactly? Oh, it's like at the other main place. I shouldn't have to walk that far. You're lost. <laughs> I just remembered I can't blow that head off today because I don't want Jules to get mad at me. Take care of which. Jules hasn't called me. I should probably call her. No, I should probably wait a few minutes. Ring. Oh, what a coincidence. Hey, Jules. Hey, we're, we are currently on the run. Apparently, something about rocks being in danger. What do you mean rocks is in danger? I don't know, but um, I just wanted to let you know. Um, is the sanctuary okay? Is everything good there? Yeah, nothing's happened, except for the fact that they moved the goddamn fridge. What do you mean? Oh, they just moved the fridge to another place. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. You did? Yeah, um, sorry, but I'm, I'll, I'll try to call you back later. Um, we're kind of in a rush right now. Okay, um, see ya, Jules. Alright, love you, bye. Oh, oh, um, that was interesting. 
Okay. Alright, then. I'm gonna have some more of my coffee. going on. Charlotte Hickory. Who is this? Hello? Hello? You, you witch. You're the one who took over Sloan and who was after Dr. Kiara. I'm not gonna let you get near her or me. It's too late though, dear. I'm already in your head. What do you mean? You'll see. Rocks. I don't know anything. You were in contact with her. I saw that. You will not lie to my face. But now, I'm going to kill you. But first, let's start off some fun, shall we? Is that a gas leak out there? Huh? Now, you know what happens when you mess with me. Let's settle this in another reality. Rocks, honey? Honey, I've been looking oh. all over for you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. I've missed you so much. I don't know. But you and I were both sent to this place of our reason. I am not sure what the reason is yet for, but I don't know why we're here. I've been trying to get in contact with y'all, but she just couldn't stop. Who can? Well, this is the one. She kept me here like a prisoner. And I can't leave. Oh, so I can't leave. Oh, my God. It's... oh no. <laughs> can't leave this temple under her magic. I never can. <laughs> She's been trying to find her daughter for a long time now to use her for some sort of spell of this book. But I'm not sort of. Who can blame her, you know? I mean... She needs to use her power for good use. Oh. You see, you just let me die. 
<laughs> and you blame yourself every day for what just happens, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I know you do. There's no harsh feelings, Rox. Because I know you just wanted to get away from space and live a normal life. You can admit it now. Which just you and me here. And now that I'm dead, you feel like you're, you're free, aren't you? Don't you think that way? You are so much to be guilty of. You think you're so innocent just because you are the sole survivor of all of this. And yet deep down inside, you don't tell your friends. You don't tell them at all. Because you're afraid that one day they'll leave you. Am I correct? That's not true. <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> Did you do? <laughs> you're now in my spell. Anyone who is under my temple, part of these rooms, are tied to it. <laughs> you're, you're, you're a wolf. Yes, I was the one who possessed Sloane. Made you go through all of this. It's nice to finally meet you. You know, I met your mother along the way. Because she's quite still alive, isn't she? <sighs> or should I say... This variant wasn't. There's a secret that your friend Duels has been keeping from you for quite some time now. You want to hear it? <laughs> well, I should just say that she was over my dead body. Or should I say her part? Her dead body. She was over her dead body. Waiting for the ambulance to arrive. And then the zero point had came and grabbed me. <laughs> I got stuck in. Exactly pulled in. She didn't try to save me whatsoever. She really never didn't. She never did. She just left right there. She knew that she would get stuck in the loop. But... She just sat there anyway. So, here's the deal. You're going to tell me where Kiara is, and in for the agreement, I will tell you where your mother is, your real mother, and you will be able to live a happy life. How does that sound? Come on, you know you miss me, Rock. Although the terrible things that I know you did wish upon me. I know you miss me deep down. You want me back in your life. So we can just live a normal life just like any other mother and daughter would. Rox, you need to wake up! Rox! Oh, she's not waking up. Mm -hmm. Come on here. You have to make a choice, or else all of us here are going to die. <laughs> and yet I still need to find Kiara. What do you say? We will live such a happy life. I don't know where Kiara is. <laughs> sure you do. You were just in contact with her. I know you were. Don't try to hide it from me, darling. Okay. Because I will decide your date if you don't tell me so. You have ten seconds. Come on, Rox, wake up! Come on! Shoo shoo, Origin, what do we do? I'm not sure. <sighs> your time is up in five, four, Three, two, one. It's your time, Rox. Rox, please wake up. 
your friends are going to be able to save you if you hear them. Just know that at least you'll be either if your mom, that variant of hers, if she actually did go to heaven, if she traveled to a dangerous reality, or you'll just not be with her at all. <laughs> <laughs> rocks! 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 <laughs> now she wouldn't tell me. <laughs> but maybe this one will. Charlotte Haggery from the <laughs> massacre of Oakville Witchcraft Academy. She will help me. <laughs> rocks. rocks, rocks. Oh my god, rocks. Are you okay? Oh god, Origin, she's bleeding. I think she broke her leg. Yeah. Don't worry, Rox, we're gonna get you to a hospital, okay? Is she gonna be okay? She'll be fine. She just broke her leg, I think. Uh, but, what about her face? What do you mean, what about her face? Just bruises. She'll be fine, okay? Okay. Just like my mother. Huh? What? I don't, I don't get it. 